Hey, what's good, everybody? Hope all is well. I am catching some fresh air out here in New York City. Listen, I wanted to share something with you guys. Well, really, pretty much just ask questions. What do you guys have? And I'm, I'm, I'm going back to the leadership thing. What do you have against deliverance? Like, if you're operating a church and there's no deliverance service, then you pretty much, you're missing the whole core of the ministry. Like, Jesus, when he was walking this earth, he preached signs and wonders follow. No one gathered around to listen to him preach, and they did not experience healing miracles you you know the church is really not teaching what they should be teaching right now they're really not and I know now that that's one of the major reasons why God pulled me out of church in 2012 I was a member an active member of a mega church um, famous pastor yada yada but I understand why now like you should not go to church and you're suffering with uh, fornication, um, you're having suicidal thoughts, you're having financial problems, you, you're having issues and you don't get deliverance. You know, a lot of issue healing, it, you, a lot of issues and different things that people are dealing with has a whole lot to do with demonic forces. Those demons need to be cast out. They need to be cast out. I encourage you to get deliverance. I encourage you that if you're not in a church where preaching is going forth and deliverance is not following, you need to get out of there. I urge you, get out of there. Um, I'm going to go now. I'm outside. It's dark now, so I'm ready to go inside. <laughs> Have a great evening. Have a prosperous new year. And um, just think about what I said. Stay focused.